in last session we found out how to select the record from the database today session i am planning to show you how to see the particular records by uh, using the link details if i click the details i only able to see the particular uh, records of this list so i am going to write the code according with that so actually it's a uh, generated as a predefined create edit details delete but the thing we are working in controller by uh, default empty stuffs so what i am going to do is i plan to create one more uh, view public with the action result actually i want to return result to be action result so the details i am giving the method name as detail and i am passing the param as id so that i can get default i set my id is 0 so now uh, here i going to return my view okay now i have the default action controller before that i just want to create my view here so i am just planning i just go and add view details create as a strongly typed i need a strongly type so that i can pass the model where object to the view find actually here i have the students model so i am select this one i want details template so that i can use that template for my view purpose so you can uh, give it a you can select the empty template and you can edit whatever the things you want so i just want to show you the details so i just select the template i just leave this uh, as a empty so that it select from the view starter okay i am just creating now a view yeah i got a details view with strongly typed student fine i just want to implement the logic here how can it's possible i just okay fine actually in details view we want to pass only a single uh, model so that so i didn't uh, get any i enumerable i enumerable as act as like it's a dynamic if suppose if you want to pass a list or some table data i enumerable it it have the multiple set of records it will loop and it will give the result as a multiple here we need a single set of output so no need we just pass uh, some variable directly to our view and we can display it so what i am going to do is i just uh, go and create the instance of student student i just call my uh, database instance the table is students i just going to find my particular id so that i can get a single record i can pass it and finally i pass to the view okay fine i just build my application my pc is very slow so it takes a little bit time okay i must click my action link student it's default it's go to the student index so now what i'm going to do is i want to see only the run record so i am just click here yep it's displaying arun marcus said seven credit how it works actually see actually there is something like student details one actually in previous session i discussed actually what it is student is a controller this detail is action and this is actually the external parameter extra parameter that we are passing this is actually called as parameter so if suppose if i pass 2 i will get the record 
of the id2 so what i will go i uh, if this thing is loading it will hit my action details because here in index what uh, it's default generated for the detail actually there is a default set of things like HTML action link name something like detail it's called action details but here we didn't mention actually any controller because if you default mention action it will uh, go and check the action in the same controller so no need to mention if uh, your action is or uh, that action method is uh, wrote in a same controller so this is actually the extra id some parameter you are going to post id i just loop and i get this item id and uh, i am just pausing as a parameter once i make action link it will make a same controller slash action and with this parameter okay once uh, this is happened it will go and check the action method and it will pause the parameter what we are uh, selected and the logic that we wrote already uh, we'll just go and find the id i will uh, explain in detail what it is actually students dot find what is actually this is actually come under the link queue so i will take one big session to cover all the link queue parameters how to works with that how to select how to insert how to join everything in a link queue session if not just go and see my playlist link queue you will get to know what are the things in the link queue the basic things i cover in my link queue session fine i think if you have any doubt please comment us i will explain you in my future sessions thanks for watching the video future video i will show you how to edit how to create how to insert the record in the database so and delete the records some interesting features i going to explain you in the future session thanks for watching the video